Hey, what's happening everybody? In this one, I am going to show you how to individually optimize battery usage in individual apps. Now that was a mouthful, but anyway, here we go. For example, YouTube music. Say you want to get better battery optimized usage out of that, right? Come over here, tap on battery, and you're going to see what I'm talking about here with your optimization, right? So right here, I basically have it set at optimized because that's what I have the whole phone set at. Basically, that's the whole situation there with the optimization and the battery. But say you wanted to go a step further and you just you wanted to do this individually with different apps. So what you could do, you could choose unrestricted and it would just run full speed doing whatever it wanted in the background. Or you could choose restricted. Now, if you went the restricted route, this bad, this this app, when it's unrestricted, will not do anything. And that goes for all of your apps. And what I'm saying is, you come over here, say you do something like that in your Gmail, and you really depend on your Gmail throughout the day, if you got that restricted, you are not going to be getting anything until you tap on it. Then maybe that's a good thing for some of you people who are just, you say you're a productivity hound and you know you're going to check on that Gmail maybe once every 30 minutes, or once an hour, whatever it is you're doing. But I don't recommend you do that because say you're not a productivity hound and you've got this thing restricted like that and you're waiting on some important emails and you're not getting that notification through Gmail because your phone is, your app itself has been set to restricted, then that is a bad move. You don't want to do that. But say you have some of these other apps, TikTok, Facebook, you go ahead and just restrict it. I mean, especially if you're trying to be more, unless you're making money through Facebook, unless you got business for real business going on in Facebook or TikTok or something, then you don't got to worry about that so much. Say you're a social media influencer of some sort, then go ahead and just let that app run. But otherwise, I'll show you, I'll give you another example, like in another one that you can do. For example, you don't want to do it in your messages either, but say you want to come over here, you want to control your, you want to control your Samsung internet browser for whatever reason you might have going on. You can do the same thing as well. So you got your same thing, unrestricted, optimized, restricted. So if you really wanted to optimize the battery usage inside of your Samsung internet, you can actually do it just the way I am showing you. And this is a very effective way. Now, remember, let me come over here. Let me swipe something away. Now, remember, I showed you all how to do this. Go to your settings, come down here to battery. And if you wanted to background usage limits, you tap over here, tap on that like that. And you see what's going on there. You can actually control a lot through here. You can actually put apps to sleep, put apps to deep sleep. All right. Also, you can come over here. You can also choose your power saving modes as well. I'm not using power saving mode. I get plenty good battery life on this Samsung Galaxy S24 Ultra. But if you want the option to use power saving mode, then this is the way, this is what you would do for whatever reason, okay? And yes, and if I was in a situation where I knew I wasn't going to be able to charge up my phone, bam, this is something I would definitely use. All right, so that's really that's a really good idea to use that. So just make sure that whatever you're doing with your Samsung Galaxy S24 Ultra, always remember to investigate all of the different settings, especially when it comes to battery optimization, because it is very, very, very possible to get some terrific battery life out of this Samsung Galaxy S24 Ultra. And I'll make another video discussing that because battery optimization, battery life, so many people are really into that, and there's so many different tips and tricks. I mean, the video could go on forever, uh, the said video that I'm going to make, but we'll see how it goes. All right, everybody. I appreciate all of you watching. Take care.